Today you will learn to make ESP8266 based RGB LED controller with a web server. Along with the source code, I will provide you the instruction for creating and using this project. Actually, we are sending a great request from our custom web page that will have a color picker to send a red, green and blue values. ESP8266 receives the data from the server and sets the color of the RGB LED based on the color picker values. So let's get started with the components required. You will need a breadboard, ESP8266 node MCU, ESP2LE development board, micro USB cable and a RGB LED. I hope you already have all the components required for this tutorial. So let's get started with the circuit diagram. Please use the following circuit diagram for a reference. When you are making this project, at each and every step, please check your wire with each step through the circuit diagram. Connect the D3 pin of node MCU to the RGB LED R pin, GND to the GND pin of node MCU, D2 pin of the node MCU to the G pin of the RGB LED and D1 to the B pin of the RGB LED. Now we will program the ESP node MCU module that acts as a server and accepts the parameter from the URL. So this is the programming code where I have included all the library error files required for this project. Here I am programming node MCU in a happy mode. Enter the access point credential such as SSID and password. You can leave the password field blank in order to deploy the open network. Similarly, I have defined the DNS port to the 53 and RGB LED in respectively. Similarly, I have assigned the IP address to the ESP board and started the ESP web server through port 80. So this is the code for RGB LED controller which is designed using HTML and CSS. In this code, it will read the RGB arguments from the web server and print those values on the serial monitor. In a void setup, we will use the pin mode function for RGB LED as output arguments and initiate the Wi-Fi in IP mode and start the DNS server as well. You will get the IP address of ESP8266 node MCU and if the DNS server is started with a certain value for a domain name called RGB, it will reply with the provided IP to all the DNS requests. In a void loop function, the two functions DNS server dot process next request and web server dot handle client function is executed in a loop. Now copy all this code and upload it to your node MCU board. This may take a few minutes while you are waiting. Please open your serial monitor and make sure it is set at 11.5200 baud rate. This time we are trying something different. So you will see a Wi-Fi network name called the IoT project. Your may be different. Switch your laptop or your mobile phone to this network. Now go to the browser and type http column double slash rgb or if it does not work try to put the IP address of the node MCU 192.168.1.5. Now the web page is displayed and you can choose the color and the RGB LED should try to match it. So I have shown you how to make ESP8266 RGB LED controller web server. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you have any doubts or queries or comments, please let me know in the comment section below. That's all for today. See you soon on the next one.